kidding. Before we run out yes. of time, let's watch that little clip because uh, Jesse White was at the Pulaski School in Chicago and gave out an award to these two young, fine kids there that took matters in their own hands and saved this little boy's life. So let's watch that clip and see what happens.
Alexander. In appreciation of the Pulaski Academy for the Life Foundation into your school to teach children how to be caring kids in action. Thank you very much. All right, folks, that was a good clip, Jesse. Um, I sure hope you have to give out a lot more of those awards because that, that is really heart rendering. Now, after the clip, we, uh, or during the clip, I should say, we brought a firefighter here with us. Uh, he's an EMT, firefighter EMT, John Scheinflug. Scheinflug, sorry. Uh, and then one of the things is that he's a Chicago firefighter, which is really cool. And where you at with what? I'm with uh, Squad One. Squad One, okay, good plug for Squad One. Uh, real quick, uh, John. Why are you with uh, Save a Life Foundation and why are you working with them? This is a wonderful program for kids to, uh, to learn something to do in a first aid emergency. I often ask parents, what would you do if you needed help? And they respond by telling me that they're going to call 911. And sometimes you can't wait or you're not afforded the luxury of waiting for an ambulance. And their children often, often will tell me that they, uh, they know what to do for a first aid emergency. And I ask them, what would you do if someone's choking? And they tell me they'll do the Heimlich maneuver. And I say, that's nice. If your parent is choking, you know how to help them. Unfortunately, if you're choking, your parent has to wait for an ambulance, and that's the time that you don't have to wait. See, that's what you're going at because of the time of the traffic and everything else. The ambulance can't get there all the time, so you need the first responders. You need to buy some time. Exactly, with the school bus drivers. Now, with Carol, your phone number is? Uh... Area code 847-928. 9683. Okay. So if they want to get a hold of you, uh, or either that or you can contact the fire, local fire department and find out more about uh, Save a Life or anything else that, you know, to do with saving lives, right? Okay, Jesse, um, anything you'd like to say? Because uh, your phone number is area code 312-814-2576. If they want to talk about a uh, call about organ donors, you get them to the right track. Uh, we have to have them call 1-800 for information because we couldn't get the phone number right off the, the bat. The other thing is, is I also would like for your listening audience to share with me any thoughts or ideas as to how I can best be of service to them. If my offices are not working to their expectation or working up to the standards I like to know about it most of the people who are there are part of a previous administration after July 1 you will see the Jesse White brand of, of, of government take take place one question I have when you were in the recorder's office you were you were accessible yes. are you still going to be accessible if people call that number yes matter of fact I'll spend about 70 percent of my time here in Chicago and 30 percent in, in downstate Illinois and Springfield. Okay, folks, you heard it from him. Pick up the phone, call, say, hey, Jesse, I've got a gripe. <laughs> right? Like they, or, they, or they could write it. Or, and, Jesse, I've got a real good compliment to give you, too, because your people did a good job for me, right? Yeah. You, you take those compliments? Yes. 100 West Randolph, room 5. 400, 5, 400. 60601. All right, at the uh, uh, Thompson Center. Thompson Center, right. All right. Well, thank you very much, John. I appreciate you coming out here thank telling you. us that all firefighters want to help. You're you're the big leader of them all, I guess. And uh, We're Carol, same effort. There you go, Carol. Thank you very much for coming thank on you for here. Having me. Jesse, next month we'll talk more uh, about organ donors, and hopefully maybe we can get a couple of bears out here. I'm going to work on it. All right. Thank you very much. I appreciate appreciate you talking to me, and uh, as always, glad to see you. Thank you. And folks. Uh, he said, call him, compliments or gripes, whatever, he'll talk to you. Thank you very much. See you next week, month, folks. Thank you.